Hey friends, and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a little different. I'm going to bring y'all along with me vlog style so you can see what it's like to be a full-time reseller. Now, if you're new here, I love to go thrifting and junking. I take those finds and I upcycle them into beautiful home decor. If that's the kind of thing you like, be sure to hit that subscribe button and the little bell next to it, and YouTube will let you know every time I upload a new video. It's been a busy week, summer's in full swing, kids are out of school, it's the holidays, I'm sure everyone can relate. I woke up super early Wednesday morning, 2.30 <laughs> to be exact, because I needed to get on to my shipping. Made a cup of coffee, chugged some water, we can do this. I'm currently in Dion Wood's book club of The Artist's Way. I'll insert a picture of the book here. And part of our assignments for this book are to do morning pages. So every morning I sit down, I write out three pages longhand, just letting all of my thoughts flow. Now this is done before any social media, any email checking, anything. I let the dog out, I get my coffee, I do my pages. I usually ship two to three times a week, depending on how many orders I have that week. This is a Wednesday, it's a shipping morning, so I put on some good music or some YouTube and I get to shipping. Okay, the great shipping debate. I know I have some fellow resellers that watch. Do y'all like to ship or not? I actually like shipping. It's a lot like wrapping presents in my opinion, and it also means that the junk is leaving my house. <laughs> Leave me a comment below. Do you like to ship or not so much? Time Go to on. take the dogs out for the 700th time, and as you see, it is a rainy, gross, humid day in Kansas. Go potty. Hurry up! Go on! Hurry up! Oh wow, that's a big stretch. <laughs> that was a tiny stretch. Go potty! Well y'all, I have got all of my stuff ready to go up to my booths today. But it is not cooperating here at Kansas. Is it? Macy does not like storms at all. I double checked my inventory after doing all my shipping and decided it was time to do a little straightening up so I got my closets nice and organized. This is all of my online inventory. I sell all of my products, paint, and these great thrifted items on my website, upcycledbybree.com. I also have two retail booths here in Topeka, Kansas, one at each Owl's Nest location. All that information though is down in the description box below in case you're curious. Confession, this bedroom furniture is still not done, but it will get done. No worries, I promise. Someday. It's life, y'all. Much better, and now I'm going to go and get ready for the day. hair up and nice and high because we have some major work to do today now y'all leave me a comment below what do y'all like to use on your face i am in my 30s and i'm getting wrinkles and acne what gives but i do have something new coming in the mail i'm excited to try it i wanted to order some for myself and then i will let y'all know what i think so i decided i would try to be cool like the young vloggers and do my makeup in my ring light and this is how this is impossible impossible
So now it's about 9 a.m. I'm gathering up all my packages that I have ready to be shipped. We'll head off to the post office. I need to go grab my paychecks, pay my booth rent, and run to the grocery store. You know, all those everyday errands. I took some time to do my inventory for all of my paint and products and I thought I would show you around one of my locations before I head out. Then all of a sudden, I don't know what happened. I tripped and fell and when I landed, I was in the thrift store. It, you know, it happens, right? <laughs> Leave me a comment below. Does that happen to you? You know, since it was so wet and rainy and gross out, I decided to treat myself with just a little thrifting, so. A little sneaky peek of what I got. Just dropped everything off at the post office and I'm going to head to the grocery store and then back home. Oh, rainy day here in Kansas. Rainy, rainy day. I left my thrift haul in the car. I took the groceries inside and I wanted to work real fast on this custom order. So I'm turning this dresser into a dry bar. I got some Durham's water putty on it, but I wanted to get the nails in it before it dried completely overnight. Shout out to Kim who hooked me up with this nail gun and my life just became so much easier. <laughs> About 4.30 p.m. I wanted to show you how pretty my hostas are. We are going to take a quick cold swim and get ready for dinner. Oh my goodness, this kid she is so resilient, just freezing cold water. I got in for a hot second and got right out, but you know, we do what we can, get a little bit of fitness in and get on with our day. <laughs> While Elena finishes her freezing swim, I am going to do a little fruit and vegetable prep while dinner's in the oven. That way I've got nice fresh foods available for the weekend. I finally got a chance to break in my new cutting board. This is the offset handle cutting board and I have it sealed up with the food safe hemp oil. So pretty. I called it an evening around 8 p.m. last night, woke up bright and early this morning because I wanted to dig this all out. I got it out of my car and I figured I'd give y'all a little sneak peek while I was getting everything organized. I separated it out into categories and put it into boxes. That way next week it will be ready for my thrift haul. Don't worry y'all, I will do a full thrift haul and we will thrift flip a ton of these items. Do you spot anything you want to see me flip? If so, tell me what it is, leave me a comment below, and I will try to do that for you next week. I decided to get a coat of stain on my custom dry bar before heading up to my booth with all those goodies you saw from yesterday when I got rained out. I will have the full video up Sunday evening of this 
dresser to dry bar makeover. You all are not going to want to miss out. We finally had a dry day, so I took advantage, changed up plans, and I am taking some stuff up to my booth. I brought in this beautiful refinished vanity and a ton of smalls that y'all have seen me flip over the past couple of weeks. So y'all wanted to know what my days are like as a reseller, how I do it all. <laughs> the days are long, but I would not trade it for the world. I love my job. And I just wanted to thank y'all so much for all of the support, the kind comments, the likes, the shares. I appreciate it all. I will be back on Sunday with a furniture flip, a dresser to a dry bar. If you need more content before then, check me out over on Facebook and Instagram. Till Sunday, I will see y'all later. Bye friends.